mean, uh, my voice is almost gone. Um, it's always tough to watch a brother compete because I can't go in there and actually physically help. So um, I'm excited for him. You know, that belt comes back home you know, to his home country of Cameroon. You know, Africa still has three belts. But Francis, that's the thing about him. He's one of those special athletes that he takes everything as it comes. Um, he was going to be able to deal with whatever was coming at him. He didn't engage or initially engage in the clinch or the wrestling in the first round that came from Gone, which I thought was an excellent game plan. But we're just seeing the evolution of heavyweights. I mean, did you see that sweep in the fifth? I mean, damn. I mean, I don't do that one. So you're seeing the evolution of the game. You said, you know, still three African champions. And of course, Izzy goes to work next month. Um, how do you see that one going down? Of course, Izzy's going to go out there and do work. I think, uh, I think he gets it done in pressure fashion as he did the first time. I think uh, Leon has grown a lot as a fighter, um, and so have I. Uh, the one thing, if that fight does happen, the one thing that, that remains true is uh, I know his heart, he knows mine when we're in there, so, you know, that's the only thing that matters. But Leon is uh, very impressive with, with the way that he has matured and he's grown in the game. He's very patient. Of course, he's always had great striking, but he's added the grappling components, and, um, you know, we see that in all his fights now. Colby Covington, Jorge Masvidal, set to meet. You know both men very well, obviously. How do you see this one going down? That's a phenomenal fight, a fight that should have happened for years. It's a very phenomenal fight. I love it. I, I can't wait to watch it. You know, it, it's, as a proud dad, I got to watch my two sons go out there and compete for me. So I can't wait.